Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel or hi hello if you are new here and thank you for joining me for today's Timu haul. I am very excited to get into today's haul although it is huge so I've decided that I'm going to split it into two separate videos. So we're going to have part one and part two because I basically have a load of fashion stuff from Timu so I thought I'd do part one as a fashion try on haul and then part two will be the rest of stuff that I've got which is kind of household stuff, travel stuff, jewellery, a whole bunch of other things that I've got which I'm going to film after this but I'll probably upload it within the next couple of days. I am working with Timu on today's video so I do have a coupon code for you. I will leave the details for that on the screen and I'll also leave it down in the description box below along with all of the links for everything that I mentioned today. Because we are doing a fashion try on haul, just for reference, I am normally a size UK 8 and I'm around about five foot three and a half. Right, let's get in to today's haul. All of the Timu clothing comes packaged like this now. When I've bought Timu clothing before, it hasn't been in its own Timu bag. So I was really excited when I was unboxing it because they actually feel really nice. Normally they're in kind of these, these very thin crackly bags. Do you know what I mean? But these are actually really nice Ziploc bags. So I'm just gonna go through everything that I've got and I will insert trial clips on the side of the screen. Ooh, okay, this feels nice. Oh, this is really cute. Okay, so this is, I think this might be quite maxi length for me, but I think it's more of a midi dress and it is in this gorgeous olive green colour. It has this lovely stretchy top part to it, the kind of bust area is all stretchy and I really, really love that design. I think it's really cute for the summer. It also has a lovely summer feel to it. It feels very light, comfortable and flowy and cooling for the summertime. The olive green colour is absolutely beautiful. I really, really love that. That's like one of my favourite colours. On the front, you do have a little tie here, which is just a detail, it doesn't actually work. And then it is stretchy around the waist area, and then it has kind of layering going all the way down it. It's I can't, it's kind of creased, but I think it is supposed to kind of look a little bit crepey, although I do apologise if uh, it's a little bit creased in the trial clips, because Ollie is currently away, and he does do all our ironing. Not that I really iron that much because I genuinely make things look worse when I iron it. So um, I normally buy things that don't really require an iron. But with something like this, I would generally wash it and make sure that I hung it to dry so that it kind of dried non-creased. But yeah, material feels lovely. And I just especially like the design of the top of this one. So I picked up this one in a size extra small. Okay, so next up I have this little cropped jumper. So this is one, well I don't know, is this a jumper? It's a cardigan really, because it doesn't do well. So it doesn't have buttons on it or anything, but it's just something that you throw over if you're a little bit chilly, just kind of over your shoulders. But I just really loved the colouring on this. It's got a lovely kind of deeper brown here, then it's got the cream colour and then it has the beige on it. And this would just go with so many of my outfits and I really don't have anything like this that I could fit inside a handbag but then when I get a little bit chilly kind of just chuck it over my shoulders. It's quite a nice thickness, it's not your thick, it's not your most thickest cardigan ever but it is a nice thing, it definitely will keep you nice and warm and I like the detailing as well down the front bit here it looks really nice. So I picked this one up in a size small, okay these look good, these look really nice. Okay, so I have these high-waisted wide leg trousers. I have been obsessed with wearing high-waisted wide leg trousers all spring and summer. They are just the most comfortable, easy to wear outfit that's nice and summery looking, but you're also still a bit covered up if it's not quite warm enough. But also it kind of looks very, I think it looks quite elegant and smart, but it's also comfortable. Um, so yeah, I spotted these on Timu and thought I would try them out. First of all, the color of these is gorgeous. And they have a really nice texture to them. I'm hoping you can see the material, but it has a very nice texture and look to it. Almost kind of a bit canvassy, linen-y feeling. And I also really like the pleat design at the front as well. I think this is going to make the shape of them look really nice. They don't have any pockets, unfortunately, which is a shame because I do love a pocket on a trouser. So that's probably the only thing that I'm not too keen about on them. But they look really nice. I really hope the length is okay on me. I'm hoping that I can wear these with just a pair of sandals, they're not going to be too long. I think they're going to be okay. Obviously you guys would have seen on the trial clips, although they might be slightly big around the waist for me. I'm not too sure, we'll see what the trial clips look like. Um, but I picked these up in a size small. Okay, next up I have a mini dress here, which this one looks so cute on the model online. I did pick this one up in a size medium. Why did I pick it up in a size medium? Because that's gonna to be too big for me, I can tell. 
Oh, that's such a shame because I even read the sizing as well and, and the medium said it was going to be my size. But, I mean, I've got to try it on. It might be okay. But I feel like the waist on this, you kind of, with this style of dress, you really want the waist to be very fitted. So, yeah, we'll have to see how this one looks. But is that not just the cutest little dress? Look at the bottom of it. I love the skirt on it. It's almost a bit like kind of tennis dress isn't it and it's pleated all the way down and then it has these two ties that you tie up on the top of your shoulder so this is just a very cutesy girly dress and I am really looking forward to trying it on but I already feel like it's not gonna fit me which is such a shame because I actually think this is such a cute little dress and I really want to take it on holiday with me but um we'll see okay next I have a pair of shorts I went for these because I thought the colour looked really interesting and I don't have any shorts this colour. They are a washed denim jean short but they have a browny, beige, almost mustardy tone to them. They definitely don't look like any of the other shorts that I've got. Um, already I love the feel of this denim, it feels um, soft and movable, do you know what I mean? It's not too stiff, sometimes I find with denim shorts if they're a little bit too stiff I find when I sit down they all kind of dig in but these feel really nice and soft and I love the fray detail on the bottom here and they look like they're going to be really high waisted I probably will wear a belt with these anyway because I quite like the look of a pair of jean shorts with a belt but yeah really it was just the colour of these that I was interested in I thought they were quite different to anything else that I've got what size did I get these in? I picked these up in a size small and the colour is called Earth Yellow another jumper oh this is cute okay next up I have this little cropped jumper I know it's summer now and this is really not what I need right now but I couldn't resist this one I thought it was really sweet I love in the winter wearing little cropped jumpers with high-waisted trousers I just think they're really sweet but this one is lovely because it looks handmade it looks like your nan's crocheted it or not even your nan anyone can crochet obviously I know that but you know what I mean it just looks very handmade and I think it's it's really sweet for the winter I love the design on it the colour's really nice and also I love the fact that it's got really long sleeves and they also have this nice is this called a bell design on the on the sleeve there where it's a little bit wider and then it goes in I'm pretty sure that's called a bell sleeve isn't it or something like that um, but I really like that design as well. So I will be popping this one away for the autumn, but I am looking forward to wearing it. And I picked this one up in a size small. And then last but not least, sticking with that kind of crochet theme, I just picked up this little crocheted knitted skirt, which this actually looks tiny. Are these skirts or shorts? Oh no, it's a short, yeah. Um, this looks very small actually, we'll see how this fits on me, but this is just to go over a swimsuit or bikini just for when you're out and about. It feels really nice as well, and I always think these look really cute as a nice little cover up, but they're really easy to pop on. Um, it does have a drawstring on the front, which does work, it is a real drawstring, so that's good. But yeah, I'm not sure, these might be a little bit tight for me around my bum, although they feel very stretchy, so... We'll see how they look on, you'll be able to see in the trial clips. But I picked these ones up in a size small. That is everything from today's Timu fashion haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I will leave everything linked down below, like I said before, and I'll pop the coupon code on the screen now and all of the details for that will be in the description box below. Definitely stay tuned for part two of today's video. And thank you to Timu for working with me on today's video. And thank you guys so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye. Mm.